Hey yo, it's your boy, right? And today we're going to play Don't Open Your Eyes. So this game, it looks intriguing, honestly, and I want to try it out. But first, let's check the options, and I'm sorry if I forget to check every time. Your boy is always forgetful every time in the morning, eh? Anyway, don't open your eyes, indeed. Let's start. What's this? Why do I have a boner on my bed? Alright. My eyes are wide open, motherfucker. It's getting late. My eyelids have begun to feel heavy. I better go to sleep. Uh-huh. I'll leave aside the book I've been reading out my window. Look out my window. The process of falling asleep is always a struggle against noise. Barking dogs, police sirens, or even my intrusive thoughts. But not even the turning gears of my brain are producing much sound. You know, there's a technique of sleeping, you know, and that is um, meditating or not trying to think of anything on your sleep. That's the thing. Anyway, and then don't put too much strain on your body and your mind because that's also going to keep you awake. It's not, it's the, you know, adrenaline or whatever that's kicking you to stay awake. Which is, yeah, making you awake. Tonight is just oddly quiet. Quiet. My eyes are wide open, motherfucker! Too quiet. I feel restless. My scythe veers towards the hallway outside my door. The distance between my room and the opposite wall is only ten steps long. I know since I've made a habit of counting them I, whenever I go out. One, two, three, absent-minded, but always. I don't know why. Maybe I just like being aware of my surroundings to the smallest of details. But tonight is different. The hallway looks like it stretches into nothingness, like sort of a gargantuan beast. Logical thinking cries that it's my imagination. There can't be anything wrong or different about it. It's just a hallway, but... I don't want to look at it. Then close the door, motherfucker! Can't you just close the door and not, you know, feel restless and tired? If you want to be, you know, less scared, there's the thing on closing the damn door. You motherfucker! <laughs> Come on, man! You close your eyes. Don't close your eyes, motherfucker! Open your eyes. Come on. I'm sorry, I feel ecstatic again. I swear. It's, it happens weirdly every morning. In my room, there's a bed. In my room, there's a cabbie. There's a wardrobe. In my room, there's a wall with pictures. There's pictures framed on the wall. My room is a part of myself. It's a world I like to know, like the back of my hat. I feel like this is a keen song. I walked across an empty land. I do the back way like the back of my hand. Okay. For someone to blindfold me, ask my way around. I do so without the slightest difficulty. As nothing, as long as nothing changes, having my eyes closed makes no difference. In this room, I can always find what I want to find. Because in this room, I know how everything looks. What's the difference? Is there gonna be... I need to wake up early tomorrow. I should really try to sleep. Stop thinking and close the damn door, Jesus. Come on. There's this thing closing the, called closing the door so you can feel, you know... What's that sound? I didn't hear the sound because I'm on my TV. I'm sorry. Are those footsteps? Probably not. I should stop screaming too. It's also early in the morning. I should control myself. But I'm a little hyped today, and I want to bust something, someone's balls at the moment. I'm kidding, I'm kidding. <laughs> or am I? Or am I, boys? I'm kidding. No, that's impossible. It must be my imagination. Wait a second. Hold up, hold up. Oh, wait, wait, wait. This reminds me of one... Okay. 
This gave me memories. I've seen this format of like visual novel before. It's called A Town Uncovered, but I'm not gonna explain why I know that. But it's getting closer. And closer. I can hear the footsteps, yeah. And closer. And closer. And, clo and they're gone. Right. There's no way someone could be here. There. Hey. Hey, motherfucker. They don't look too good. Open. Open your eyes. Open your eyes. No. I won't. Open your eyes. Look. Why won't you look at me? Where are your manners? If a stranger asks for help, is it right to ignore this? That. Okay. Okay. It's cold. A secret with you. I have never seen myself before. Bullshit. Go look at the mirror. If my face is ugly. There's this thing called a mirror, and yeah, you look at it, and I feel sorry that you're ugly. Okay, yeah, that makes sense that they don't look at it. I'm really sorry, my guy. Uh, uh, don't worry, you're beautiful in the inside, that's all. I don't all. know the color of my skin. Does that matter? I, you're still human, man. Uh, we, yeah, well, you, you don't look human, but yeah, you're still human, my guy. I don't guy. know if I'm even here. Well, existential crisis is quite a heavy thing, honestly. It's really hard to deal with, but I swear you'll get through it, my guy. We, we can beat it together. I need you to open you so you can tell me how I look. No, you do it on your own this time, because the best I can do is give you advice. <laughs> so I can tell you, you can tell me how I look. I'm also shy. Do I trust this guy? I know you're not listening. Listen. With those tiny ears of yours, they look so fragile. Like I could almost grab them. Put my All fingers right. around them. And rip them open. Rip tear and tear. Them off. Exactly. If you scream, will I hear your voice? Yeah. No. I don't know. I'm joking. Don't be scared. Very funny. I'm laughing so hard right now. It's terrifying. Like that, come on, my guy. There's this thing called being a borderline psychopath and there's being, you know, a joker. You're not crossing, you're crossing one line and that's not a joker. Hey, how do you think my eyes in our case is finally? I don't know. It's my fault because I didn't close the damn door before I was sleeping. And yeah, I'm gonna. I think Mark. I seen Markiplier played this before. And yeah, we both have the same issue of this motherfucker not closing his door when he sleeps. Like, come on, man. They look empty. They look empty. Is it just we or we just see Maybe what we so. wanted to see? The eyes are the window to the soul. That's what someone told me. Long ago, they said that the soul was holy, bright, beautiful. Every person has uh -huh. one, both the good and the evil. But that person said I was the exception. That something like me couldn't possibly own something so holy, so bright, so beautiful. They looked inside of me, took I a swear. deep breath, and announced their conclusion with great fatigue. Their eyes, eyes that could see it all, yeah. couldn't find anything in there. I'm sure that if you were to cut me apart, not even blood would flow out, even if I felt it sometimes crawling through my veins. Maybe that's why I've never seen myself before. Dude, I know there's something good within you. They don't have to load yourself all the time, I swear. There's some good qualities in you. You're, um, 
You look pretty tall, my guy. I mean, you can probably beat every basketball player in existence, but I don't know. We just gotta work hard just to, you know, practice those dribbling skills, you know what I mean? Even though I never play basketball. Because I'm empty. No, you're not. You're worth something. Isn't that something to be grateful for? Because if I were to look and find nothing there, then surely I would feel disappointed. By not looking, I can ease myself of that pain. So maybe this is for the best. I can't remember uh, who was the first to recite these Kind of a part of a, you know, making it like a coping mechanism, but... I just hope it works, you know, because sometimes when you, you that thought will come and then you will feel bad again, and that's the thing. I can't remember who was the first to recite the these second, words to me. Nor the third, nor the several others who came after. The only thing I remember is that they looked as empty as I did to them. Hey, have you ever felt so empty, so devoid of what makes everyone special? That you've embraced the void as your own. Bruh. Bro, that just hit home. Bruh. How, how do you know that? Huh? Hey, wait a second. Is this some, si so, some sort of psychological game where it has to reflect my own personality in my life? Come on. You don't, don't dig through my personality. Okay, I didn't fully embrace the void until I learned my shit, okay? So don't you dare judge you, me. These eyes are these. My eyes. Well, if you embrace the void, technically, if I'm if this is a reflection of myself, a you probably answer. Yet there is only one way to know the truth. Open your eyes. So you won't look at me. Even though your eyes are so pretty, I can't see them, but I can imagine them behind their veil of flesh. Yeah, I, my eyes are brown, and I, some people told me that I have good eyes, so yeah, kind of creepy already. No, brown get away. Pearls. No, they're actually a little shiny flat, but jewels. no. Brown is kind of shiny when it's on the sunlight. So, so. Stay away from my eyes, guys, uh, dude. Just stay. How about you take my bad eye? You keep the. How about I keep my good eye? It's fine. We still have time. The night is no. still and silent. Ew, 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 ew. I feel violated. People are good at closing their doors. See what I mean? This guy, I swear, I'm gonna kick their ball. Do you know what a door is? Apparently, this guy doesn't know what a door is. You have one right there at the verge of your little world. A door is a barrier to keep the bad out. Exactly. That or you don't have arms or hands. Should I turn the knob left or right? Should I try to take it off its inches? Should I chip away at it? Hoping it will fall apart. And what happens when it opens? You know, there's this thing called kicking the door till it breaks. Unless it's a metal door. That you can just, you know, use a bomb to explode the door. So yeah. There's many ways to open a door. But there are better ways to keep the door intact. Well, uh, Do I, I don't keep know. It open? But that might be rude to the person who had it closed. But then, how do I get out? And what happens if the wind pushes it close? What then? So many options. I don't know. So many things that could I know. go wrong. You're, dude, you're overthinking it. Calm down. Whenever I stand in front of you a need to steal my guy. It paralyzes me. I stare at it for a long time and think of my excuses because that's all they are. What bothers me the most about closed doors is the idea they exist to keep me out. Aww. 
Uh, that sucks, my guy. me with the need to go in. So I search for I a crevice feel bad for you, my or a window. Anything that might be open. Anything that might let me in. I'm not good with doors. But as long as there's a place where I can fit, then I can go in anywhere. Every night, I hop across the shadows of the streets. I'm careful so as to not be caught by the light. In my eternal search, I pick a place where to rest. I slip in and spend the night wherever is comfortable without alerting anyone. Usually it's a cellar, an attic, anywhere with dust, with dirt. I feel at home there. But sometimes... That's sad life, my guy. I feel bad for sometimes. you. Not everyone has the chance to live in decadence and luxury. I wish you will get yours. An urge swells inside of me. The urge to be seen. So I search hard for a door that's open. For an entryway covered in darkness. And for uh -huh. someone to be at the other end. Awake as if uh -huh. expecting me. But you won't look at me. Even though you had your door open for visitors, why is that? Are you afraid to I? No, I'm a dumbass who no. forgot to open, to beat. close the fucking door. But anyway. We have been chatting for so long. You haven't chased exactly. me out. That uh -huh. means you welcome me. So I'm certain that if I were to reach out my hand, uh -huh. you would reciprocate. Oh. Hey, 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 what you touching there? Okay, thank God. Thank God. So very warm. Because people yeah. are always warm. Hey, are you? Yeah, you feel cold. My hands. When my warmth finally meets yours, answer me. Well, let's be, fe let's be honest. Honestly, we see it's incomplete in our view. They don't look deceitful and neither is tired, but I'm pretty sure in his perspective he's tired. They look tired. Yeah. Tired. Oh my jeez. That may be so. These fingers of mine have touched so many things. They are always yeah. stretching forwards, reaching out for I know. something. The tip of my fingers dance over the surfaces that I travel. And their sensations reach the core of my brain. Be it the yeah. softness of the first spring flowers. Or the roughness of a wall made out of rubbish. Caressing. Grabbing. Clock. No matter the time of day. No matter if I'm awake or asleep. As if they had a mind of their own. Even now. They clutch onto the fabric of your bed sheets. Yeah, they I like know. how these thousands of threads intertwine with each other. The rustle of fabric exactly. against fabric, of skin against skin, is irresistible. No, no, uh, ghosty dude or whoever you are, I think you would make a good writer. Your attention to detail is really high quality. I guess you can just you can really write a story out of this, my guy. You know. We just need to give you a good publisher, a good place to publish your stuff, and yeah. I think you're gonna be a great writer, my guy. Let's go. Let's be sure you're going international, because come on, we like to hit the international audience time to time now, eh? They want more. Uh-huh. They want to feel closer, to have it between them and around them. Mm -hmm. However, they can reach as far as they'd like. That's when I lend a hand. I mm -hmm. take over and stretch, 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 and they grow. Maybe just the length of a fingernail every time. But they grow just so they can reach out, clutch what they want, and then throw it aside, discard it. Yep. That's why they are really. tired, because they never stop seeking, and most uh -huh. likely, never will. 
Well, yeah, I'll never. I, for me, that is. This is kind of like a reflection of myself. At this point, technically, yeah, I'm never satisfied of what I want. I tend to look for things that makes me satisfied until I, I got bored and find another thing. Technically, that's how humans work. But mm, for me, it's way you know. Well, um, r rampant or probably ra all most of the time. Have you ever stretched your fingers to grab hold of something important? Well, if I can't get a key from the back of the cabbie, oh, yes. To learn that it's been long out of your grasp. Oh, okay, that just sucks. Have you? Yes. These hands. Yes. Those are hands. There's only else. one way to know if I'm open. For the f your for the love of fuck. I told you I'm not gonna look so at you your eyes. Me, even though my hands could be the same as yours. Because I'm basically a reflection of myself in this game. I it's literally a talking mirror in your dreams. I swear, if you play this game, it might reflect your deepest, you know, whatever it Think is. Think about it. Why am I so chill about this game uh, talk exposing my personality? Anyway. No, I know we are. I can feel it in my skin. Oh. Mm -hmm. oh. Can you hear it? My skin what? is pulsating. It has You're having a heart. It's a sign of my innermost emotions flowing out. I want That's great. The world wanting to be seen. Um, it's not great. Look, but it's not like anyone will do. If it did, then it would be oh so easy, since I could show myself to everyone at once, every living person in this land, and ask them all the same question. Someone will answer. There's no doubt about it. But uh huh. It might not be the answer I wish for. Since I don't want to be judged, I don't want uh -huh. to be perceived as something I'm not. It scares uh -huh. me. That is why. I know. When someone is on the verge of looking at me, I shy away. I hide, fading into the dark. But you. Don't worry, man. I, I, you can, I can look at you. You just need to, you know, show yourself more on the art it's side. You. You're still a it bit incomplete. To stand still, if only for a second. That way you can help me, and we can both be fulfilled. Uh, just thinking about it, it makes me feel... feel Happy? Something. I cannot describe it. I am not good with words. Pro probably a happy. person in my past. You sure you can't talk? Uh, you sure you can't talk? I mean, you literally made some, you know, the very descriptive type of, you know, dialogue. And then you call yourself, you know, wordless. And you call that guy bad. Dude, I think he taught you well. You're just being an ass now. Come on. Simply because they could. It is weird to remember. Because it makes me think of why I want to be seen. And I am not. Sure. I don't care much for my appearance. I don't want to be judged. But if that were it, I could easily stay out of sight. So why is it? Why do I want someone to recognize me so much? Because you need a friend, man. You're lonely. I'm I'm willing to be friends with you if you won't stop if you don't if you stop being lonely and I can help you out. We could probably hang. We could play some Mario Kart. We could Write something together, or I don't Maybe know. It's only because I can, because everyone gets to be recognized. But I will soon. Once you open your eyes, ah, there it is again. Just thinking about the moment you unveil your sight onto me, and you finally take those bed sheets off your body, and you inspect every crevice of mine. 
Okay, dude, you're, you're sounding a bit too creepy now. Do Stay away finally, from me, body. Finally, finally, open those tight lips of yours. No, I won't kiss you. Get out. Or if I'm a woman, that's not even a great thing. So I'm going to punch you if you're going to do something do creepy. Let me hear what I am, and to maybe even give me a name. It makes me feel, but I don't know what. Surely it would be evident if you were to look at my face. Hey, what does my expression? When that fill of uncertainty finally disappears, answer me. Well, honestly, you look like... Hmm, let's think, let's think. So, okay, okay, okay. So right now you're feeling excited and stuff, but then again... Do you even... you feel pain? I don't know. It's a between emotionless to cheerful. I know it's being happy right now. But honestly, overall emotionless. Stare. Exactly. That may be so. Expressions are difficult. They require one's face to contort in many different ways. I am not capable of that. Everything about I feel me bad. Is stiff. something I noticed long ago and never changes huh? I may hurt and I may grow but I do not change not in the way other people do fuck for fuck's sake it hits straight to home can you stop reading my personality like a page like book right now it really annoys me with each other. it's hitting me in my deep spots I hate it they form connections Person becomes someone different with each passing second. Turning old and perishing. However, I don't think I'm capable of any of those things. My journey began long ago, longer than any person has ever journeyed. And in my life, I have seen others dude. born and died. Dude, I've seen. Dude, I swear that the change that you're waiting for it to happen. It's gonna happen soon. You just need to make it happen. Like, uh, you know, working hard to it. Like, right now you're chatting to me. That's enough for you to get that chance, you know? Born and die. A person's existence is so fleeting. And yet, so many things happen to them. So many worthwhile memories. It is something I lack. Were I to write a book, I could not fill a single page. It's not for the lack of memories. But rather, because these memories mean nothing to me. Interesting. And very interesting. That's not really me now. Because I do record my memories now, right now. Say that's interesting. Number, they are all the same. Blending very with each other into a mottled gray. Lacking the meaning people often give to that which they care about. Perhaps, if someone else had lived what I had, they would see meaning. They would treasure it. But I cannot. No matter how I try, I can't see any worth in what I do. And by extension, I think I'm I changing. Am. That's why I realized it doesn't hit the... It hits different. But I can feel this guy. I, I, I get it. For someone. I, oh, damn it. Yet, I don't see that as important. I feel like I have a wart on my hand and I'm getting annoyed. You know what it feels like to get warts now and then. And it's a nightmare. No one but me would care. So why should I care? But that doesn't mean I have never felt. I feel things. Joy. That is so a fact. Fear. I am always feeling. And right now. strongly it's here in my pulsating skin you say my expression is emotion and if you say so but soon you will see something because what i'm feeling hey 
Uh -huh. Have you ever masked yourself with indifference? Only to Not hide really. the overwhelming emotions hiding beneath. Have you? This expression. Yeah, probably. Is this my expression? No. Is that so? No. What does my expression want that fill of uncertainty? A I think it's a smile now. Smile. That may be so. It would only make sense for it has been so. I can no longer remember. But who did maybe the starting point? The earliest one I was walking, and for some walking. reason, it was daytime. It was I daytime. During the daytime, only when the fear of being seen isn't there. So I must have believed. But it's strange, since the place uh -huh. I was walking through was a city, one full of people. I couldn't see them, but I knew they were there, hiding in the shadows, with their backs against the dirt, completely motionless, complete living in weight of their deaths. And what's yeah. more, none dared to look at me. Oh. Did they even know I was there? Maybe they did not care. Okay, okay, wonderful. This is another... I kind of get... Okay, last... The emotional state, I think I got over this. That. I thought this one just hits way too close again. They were like me, living in fear of what others might think. Well, actually, no. And who's to say I wasn't one of them? Maybe I spent my days as part of the scenery as well. Or probably, yes. One day I decided to... Go for a walk, walk that hasn't yet found its end. It's my earliest uh -huh. memory. And my most joyful one. No experience afterwards that made me want to smile more than that. So if you say I am smiling, then surely. But tonight, so if my expression is uh -huh. truly one, then I must be lying through my smiling teeth. Hey, have you ever expressed honest happiness in your face? In reality, yeah. you're feeling anything but... Yes. This expression. I do, actually. You know your boy. I smile, but there are some issues, yeah. But then again, I just do my thing. I just. Is this? I see. Yeah. Thank you. That's you have truly. These are my eyes. These uh -huh. are my hands. And this uh -huh. is my expression. I consider these my most treasured features, and you have helped me picture them all. No one has done yeah. this for me. I feel a connection with you, one born out of honest gratitude. But there is one step left. You need yeah. to make sure of the truth. It is the only way to finally understand each other. So please, I beg of you, open your eyes. You know what? Before we do that, let's save. Yes. What do you see? There was nothing. Huh? There was nothing. That's it? Seriously? You know that all that anticipation just wasted. No. 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 What I if see. I say no? I understand. No. no. It's fine. You have still helped me by answering my questions. No one has uh -huh. done that for me before. So I have no right to ask for anything else. No, no. you st you can still ask. Ever since I stepped into this room. You have refused to engage with me. Not even once. Uh -huh. Not even once. 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 Yeah. Did not even once. You stayed there, acting as if you were asleep, feigning ignorance and not moving an inch. At times, making me believe that our conversation was just in my head. You haven't opened your mouth, but you didn't yeah. need to. I can hear far, uh -huh. far beyond what. Most others can, and I can see further than what others would consider the dark, empty bottom. That's why I know that I wasn't wrong. You are uh -huh. like me. We are the 
insane. You ought to look for what's not there. You too. Reach out for what might hurt you. And you too yeah. are a liar. No. Uh, no. No, no way. No, 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 no. That, that, hey, no. No way. I, I, no, I'm pretty honest myself. No. How come? The type that shows one thing and feels another. But you made a mistake. I know you're lying. Because every answer you've given me so far has been wrong. I am not what you said I am. These eyes, these hands, this expression. What? They aren't mine. Maybe. They are yours. But I do not care. Not anymore. Open. You're... I didn't want to be judged. I didn't want to be perceived for something I'm not. And that's all you did. So now, and see me for what I can. You said so. Remember that in this room, you know how everything looks. It was those words. So you have, you have to do right by that which you claimed. It is time. Open. I feel like I need to save before we do this. Open. Triple dots. Open your eyes. You had your no. chance. It's not up to you anymore. You won't open your eyes. I will. Well, I'm dead. Ow, 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 ow. I... We heard something crack and we died. Your eyes are... Tell me, my new friend. What do you see? It's the void. What the? Two X's and two I's. Uh huh. Is that supposed to scare me? That won't do. I close my eyes. Open your eyes. Ow! Open them. Open them that hurt. now. Up. You, you're never gonna open my eyes because even though if I open them, you're just gonna disappear. Oh no, it seems I did it again. You can't see anymore, right? You can't talk anymore, right? You can't think anymore. Then, thank you for trying, the? friend. Even though you are a liar, I'm not. Uh, I leave damn this it. piece of myself. I should have chose the emotionless route, but damn it. I must go. I must look for the right person. Someone. Someone who can explain why everyone looks like that. Uh huh, uh huh. What is it? Ah. Uh. Well, you're blind now. What is this game? This is interesting, Open. I mean. You had your chance. It's not up to you. you won't. I will. What the? I said yes. Open. Open. Okay. I think it's over, guys. Because I press yes. You had your chance. You I, uh, Tell me what. Nonetheless, we lost. By the way. Yeah, that's all for don't open your eyes, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Leave a like, subscribe, hit the bear, hit the bear, hit the bell, share the video. Look.
look me check me out on my socials down below and i'll see you in the next video goodbye and have a nice day and i should have picked the emotionless route